Speaking of future plans, not only a fix, but a major renovation of the water garden. Downtown Corpus Christi could be coming soon. The city this week approved a design contract to look at different ways to improve that attraction. Our Brian Burns is live at the water garden for us tonight, Brian. Well, Joe, actually, the council approved a contract for some $360,000 to pay the design firm that's in charge of coming up with upgrade ideas for the water garden. The controls and pumps for the water garden have had mechanical problems in the past and were severely damaged and knocked out of service by Hurricane Harvey almost two years ago. Instead of simple repairs, experts say the controls for the garden need to be redesigned so that they're not susceptible to future storms and flooding. City Council Member Paula Guajardo says the city garden means to the city what the river means to San Antonio. It's an attraction here in the city, and it really is. And not only for tourists, but you have people that used to get married down there. I mean, that's one of the most important days of your life. And, and that's how important, and that's how beautiful, and that's how high up that, you know, our citizens hold this particular attraction. Now, during two recent workshops, council members agreed that funds used to maintain the seawall could also be used to fix the water garden. I'd just like to point out that in the last 20 minutes we've been standing here, we've seen at least two groups of people taking pictures of their children in graduation outfits, and that's how popular this area always seems to be. Now, there's no timetable on when the designers will come back with some ideas for the council to consider. Live from the Water Garden, Brian Burns, 3 News. Joe? All right, Brian. It would be nice if the water were there in the Water Garden.